The last writing skills lesson I taught was just before the Christmas holidays. The week before the lesson, students specifically asked me to have a lesson about New Year's celebrations around the world. I decided to use the topic in my writing skills lesson. At the start of the lesson, I asked the students to tell their partners about how they celebrate New Year in their country. This was a very short activity, and it really just got the students thinking about the topic of the lesson. I then regrouped the students so that they could work with the students from the same country. I had four groups of three and four students in each group, with one group representing South America as a continent rather than individual countries, which worked very well. In their groups, students were asked to brainstorm vocabulary related to New Year celebrations. I gave the students about four minutes to do that, and then we collected all the vocabulary on the board using a mind map. By then, I knew students had enough language to get them started on the first draft of their writing. I asked the students to work as a group and write individual sentences about New Year's celebrations. They could now use the vocabulary on the board and their own ideas. This stage took about 10 minutes. If the students had to work individually, it would probably have taken less time to complete the task, but working collaboratively means students had to discuss and negotiate their ideas. Once done, the students exchanged their papers with another group and the new group checked the sentences for mistakes and added suggestions. Papers swapped back again, students were now brainstorming how to connect the original sentences and organise them into coherent paragraphs in order to write a longer essay. At that stage, students were really into the activity discussing ideas and agreeing on the content of each paragraph. Once the group had the first rough copy of the text, they swapped the completed paragraphs again, and the new group had to provide feedback on the language and the mistakes, as well as on the organisation of the text. This included suggestions for the opening and closing paragraphs. Paragraphs swapped back the students had to rewrite the text to include the suggestions made by the other group. I was monitoring the students very closely throughout the lesson, supporting individual groups, giving suggestions, offering new vocabulary where needed and so on. I also played some background Christmas music to get the students in the right mood. The whole lesson progressed from generating ideas and structuring the text through to drafting, editing, redrafting, and reviewing the text before the final versions were presented to the rest of the class. The collaborative nature of the lesson meant that apart from writing skills, the students had multiple opportunities to develop their speaking skills as well.